So here we have it, the kickoff for the 2010 AFF Suzuki Cup. Indonesia desperately need an early goal to have any chance of overturning that 3-0 thrashing they suffered in Malaysia. Real shocker, that one. Well, there was a suspicion that uh, Indonesia have suffered in a way because they've played all their matches away from home. And a, a flap, a chance there. They're asking for a penalty and they get a penalty. Indonesia with a possible breakthrough here. Off a header that was aimed at goal. Well, we'll get a better look at this, I'm sure. And this is the early opening they would have wanted. Now they've just got to put that penalty. It's a yellow card as well for Mohamed Sabri. Now, if that was an intentional handball, surely a red card would have been the appropriate punishment. It's a big one. Will Carol Fami save the blushes for Malaysia? Oh, that's a poor penalty! That's an absolutely shocking penalty. There's a chance there. Oh, that's a wonderful save. That's a great shot as well from the edge of the box. Mohamed Ashari with the first real opportunity for Malaysia. Keeper comes out. It's going to go in. Oh, it hasn't. Unbelievable stuff here. It's come off the crossbar. It didn't cross the line. Still haven't been able to do much here. Apparently, the players have regained some confidence after receiving strong support. A charge here for Malaysia. Can they pull the trigger? They do. And that's an incredible goal. What a stunner from Mohamed Safi who's now scored three goals in the finals overall. And that surely is the end for Indonesia. What a stunning finish for the striker, who couldn't score at all in the early stages. And their reaction from Marcus Harrison tells you all, Malaysia now four up on aggregate, on the break, drifting in between the two defenders, and that's an unstoppable finish. Top quality from the Malaysian striker. No chance whatsoever for Marcus Harrison. Less than 20 minutes to go, plus an added time. Uh, again, took too long with that, and there's a chance. Oh, what a save. And finally they get the goal. Well, I'm not sure why they're celebrating so much. They should be grabbing the ball and getting back there. It's a goal from Mohamed Nasua. Well. He'll be happy, but I'm not sure that's going to be enough. They need a few more of those. Well, that's come way, way too late for them, but let's see what happens now. Well, I can't believe there was so much space there. Mohamed saw with a good finish. Eka Ramdali with a great run. Again, chance for another Malaysian break. Mohamed Safi, the goal scorer. Tries to put a cross in. That's a good attempt. Well, almost another Malaysian attempt on goal. They've looked threatening, haven't they, in the break from time to time. They don't get too many opportunities. Here's Eka Ramdani. I think they've certainly missed uh, the talents of Octavianos. There's another goal. Well, oh, they need to grab it quickly. And uh, Mohamed Redwan, who was a bigger threat in the first half, gets another goal. I think care of a deflection. As I said at this stage, it's only a little bit of a consolation. But uh, any excuse for the Indonesians to celebrate, I'm sure they'll take. He cut inside instead of cutting to the byline. Took his chance reasonably well. I think it came off. A Malaysian defender will have a better idea here. Yes, it did. Otherwise, you feel 
that he had a chance of stopping it, Karol Fami. Bam Bam Pamonkas will take this. He's got to be quick with this. He's got to score it immediately. It's on goal. That's a great free kick, and what a fantastic save by Karol Fami, who for me has been Malaysia's man of the match today. He's been absolutely stupendous between the sticks. Made some crucial stops. Surely now the whistle will go. And there you have it. The AFF Suzuki Cup 2010 goes to Malaysia. History in the making as Malaysia take the championship for the first time in their history. Raja Gopal Krishnasamy has overseen a wonderful tournament for his team. They started terribly, but peaked at the right time. And it's been a very entertaining match. Indonesia have dominated it from start to finish, but they couldn't take their chances. The final score here at the Gulora Bung Karno Stadium. Indonesia 2, Malaysia 1. But Malaysia do take the championship. And now, the FS Cup Trophy is handed over to the captain of the Malaysia team, Sabik Bin Rahim. By Mr. Andy Malerangi, Youth Expert Minister of Indonesia, and Mr. Francisco Kabuadi, EMF Council Member.